guys what's up so I just wanted to let you know before I start this video before we get into it um as you guys know I have been having like a cold a little bit but I am fine now I mean I still have the cough I mean I've had a sore throat and a cough but I, the sore throat's all gone thankfully um but the cough is still here <coughs> but it's not as bad now it was for a couple days, but now it's fine, and it's getting better a lot, so that's good. Just a little positive vibe for you, or positive news, and if you are suffering from anything like that, or mental illness, or anything like that, just know that you are not alone. I suffer from anxiety, so it's a lot, um, but yeah, so... <coughs> let's get into this video okay so uh, in today's video for this Thursday's video I thought I would give you like four signs that you are with the guy of your like dreams like this guy's yours forever you know because I've been reading on it and it got really interesting I want to do a lot of relationship videos. I've done a couple like a year and a half ago, probably almost two years. It's crazy. I've already been on this channel. I've already been on YouTube for over three years. But yeah, um, let's get into it. So the first sign is, I mean, this is just from random. It's not like the first, second, third, fourth. I'm just picking random ones that I thought really stood out to me. There's others out there. If you know one, comment down below. And if you have any ideas of relationship themed videos you want me to do, make sure to comment down below, like this video, share it, and subscribe if you haven't already. I'm almost up to 120, 120 subscribers, which is really cool. So yeah, um, so yeah, let's get into this video, Tiffany. So yeah, uh, the first sign is when, like, I don't know what this is called, but the first sign is, say if you go to a party that's really boring and you're like, come on, please, honey, let's, let's go. Let's, let's really, I really want you to go. And then he, after a while, he or she, not saying anything, you know, I believe in one love, but, um, he or she will be like, oh, like he or she will give in and make sure, you know, I might, yeah, that make sure that you're the one, like, he will, he or she will go to that party, and it might be boring, and he or she, he or she will, that person, I'll say that person, that person with you will, you know, make sure you have a good time and stuff, even though they aren't, they are not, um, yeah, and that will continually happen, and yeah, that's the first sign. That was number one. And number two is they will, this person is not afraid to tell you they're friends. They're not afraid to be like, oh, um, I have this friend. I don't know if you like it. But, you know, they'll be comfortable with letting you know what who your, your, their friends are. And then once that happens, you'll be comfortable enough, I hope, to do that also to tell you. To tell that person, he or she, you know, that you can tell them your friends and that they can tell you their friends. Both of you will be able to trust each other like that. And that's a really, really good sign. So that's the second sign. That was the second one. Number three is say if that person is he or she is going like gets a really big job opportunity and doesn't tell you until the last minute they will not make you go there just for them they want to make sure that your dreams are still your dreams and that their dreams are still their dreams and that even though it might be hard say they'll have to go for like a month or two maybe a year it might be hard long distance but it doesn't matter if you both love each other and you can contact through video chat, texting, calling, you know, 
this <coughs> those ways and it's really important that's a really important one and that is also a really really good sign that you are the with the one now that was the third one the last and final one number four the fourth sign and this is a really, really important one as well, just like all the others that I have named. Let me just tell you again, this is probably like the fourth time you've heard this, but I'm just going to say it anyways. Again, um, this, all these signs are great signs. They're important, 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 important signs. But there's also other signs too. There's also a lot of other signs and, you know, awesome these are all great, awesome signs. So, yeah, number four. <coughs> I'm really, really sorry. Um, yeah, so number four. The fourth and last sign I'm going to be telling you is, you know, you guys can trust each other. Like, you are not, you're not constantly, that, yeah, you are not constantly feeling the need to look over their, like, over their shoulder or check their phone when they're not looking. Like if, say if the phone's like right here and you go, they're not here, maybe I should check because they've been acting funny and I don't want them to, lo I don't want to lose them. If you're having thoughts like that, then you don't trust th your partner and then if they found out, which they will, like always, they will not trust you either and then you guys will get into a fight and then you guys will not get together again probably but sometimes that happens a lot of the a lot of the time it happens it depends on the relationship how it's going how much you trust each other trust is really important like i said like if you don't feel the need to constantly just look at his phone like look at his or her phone look at their phone partner's phone if it's sitting there and you're not and you're like i trust that person i trust i trust my partner i trust my soulmate I don't feel the urge to do that. And then that person, if you tell them that, they will come up front and say, you know what, I trust you too. I don't feel the need to do that either. Look at your phone when it buzzes or look at a notification that pops up and lights up. I don't have to go like, what? Who is that? And then it like be an Instagram photo that someone sent you or something or a message or whatever or a request a video call, anything like that. Um, because sometimes in relationships, people will be like, what is that? And then it'd be like a news notification. And then they go, like, they start to realize, you know, maybe this relationship isn't going to work because I can't stop looking at that phone and worrying that my partner is talking with another guy or another girl or whoever. And then that's a bad sign of your relationship going downhill. And I want to do... Yeah, so that's it for today's video. I hope you got something from this. Hope you enjoyed it. And I want to do some videos on, like, signs about if in, if you're in a, an abusive relationship or if your guy isn't the right one, like, s sort of in the concept, in the, you know, sort of in the whole idea of abusive relationships. So just, just that. Or signs that... He doesn't love you, or stuff like that. It's basically an abusive relationship. And there are certain red flags, and I might do that. Like the 10, there's like 10 red flags in a relationship that is gonna start to go deeper and deeper. If you don't do something about it, it will harm you and you may even end your life. So I'm definitely gonna do that video pretty soon. I'm not sure when, but overall, hope you guys got something from this like this video, comment down below, some relationship themed videos, share this video please. I worked really hard on, you know, making videos for you guys and putting a lot of energy in because I really want to do this. I love this so much. So yeah, I love you guys. I will see you next Monday for the next video. Not sure what it will be, but it will be a video. Fun, amazing. And I do know that I can always talk to you guys if I'm ever feeling upset or something happened in my family that I feel like I can share with you guys. I mean, there are certain things I can't share with you guys that I wish I could on YouTube, but there are certain guidelines and all that. So, 
yeah, I love you guys. Hope I will see you next Monday and then next Thursday, every two weeks, every week, Monday and Thursday. Hope you guys have or had an amazing day. If you're watching this on the same day I posted it, amazing. Or if you're just catching up on my videos and this is the first video you're seeing of me. Hi, I'm Tiffany. I make a really great videos, I think, and I know a lot of people like them. And I hope you do too. If you're not yet subscribed, please subscribe, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe, turn the notification bell. If I, I think I have one, I'll have to check. But if I do, turn that on and it will notify you every time I upload, most likely, because sometimes YouTube gets messed up and they have to work on it. YouTube is amazing. I love them. So yeah, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and I will see you and subscribe and I'll see you next Monday and Thursday. Bye.